the last week in March of 2014, I went to a banquet. And the next day, I didn't feel very well. And I thought, oh, it must be the food that I ate at the banquet because I had kind of an upset stomach. So I called my nurse practitioner and I said, I think I need to see you. So the next day she had me go for an ultrasound. And when they were doing my ultrasound, they saw a mass at the head of my pancreas. Being a nurse, and as soon as I heard that I had a mass at the head of my pancreas, I said to my nurse practitioner, I guess this means I'm going to die. And I believed it. And I know that because I was in phase one of the ascorbate clinical trial that nobody can tell me that the ascorbate really helped me fight the cancer, but I will always believe that it did, and I always will be thankful that I was at University Hospital to be part of that clinical trial. I started having CTs done every six months, and I just had one the end of March, and there's no cancer that's seen. I feel perfectly fine. I do the things that I did before I had cancer. I take care of my yard, I do all my yard work, I take care of all my flowers, I exercise, I walk every day, I still bake cookies. I just do all the things that I, I enjoy doing. I'm happy to tell you this, I'm going to be 70 in two months and in April of 2014 when I was diagnosed with pancreatic cancer. I didn't think I'd ever reach the age of 70.